Hello and welcome to B2B Topics and Tips, bringing you the latest buzz about small business topics, tips, and expert interviews. Watch live or watch later. Drop any questions or thoughts into the comments and if you're watching later, feel free to use hashtag replay. Hi, I'm Melissa St. Clair, Communications and Standard Operating Procedure Specialist at Paper Chaser Biz LLC, a certified military spouse owned enterprise. And what are we talking about today? Today's topic is five tips for time blocking. And I love this quote from Napoleon Hill, plan your work and work your plan. As a military spouse, I heard the acronym POD a lot, meaning plan of the day. It's always great to start with a plan. So there's lots of talk about time blocking. It's a practice I use. And are you wondering how to use time blocking optimally? Well, here are my five tips for time blocking. One. Start with high level priorities. For me, client work always comes first. Number two, place buffers between tasks. So that gives you a minute to refresh and reset between projects. Three, schedule breaks. Everybody deserves a break, a lunch break to fortify yourself in the middle of the day. Because if you're not taking breaks, and you keep going full steam ahead, your brain is going to take a break automatically and unexpectedly. And instead of typing year, you might type team. Number four, add blocks for reactive tasks. Some of those things that pop up unexpectedly uh, that you may need to attend to for your client or for yourself or something personal even. Number five, put in downtime for you, for relaxation, for learning. Set aside time for professional development or pleasure reading. Using time blocking gives me a guide how I will be using my time each day. Want more tips like this? Subscribe to the Buzz newsletter. Opt in at bit.ly forward slash the buzz news. I'll also drop that link into the comments. Thanks for watching.